Hello, and thank you for joining to hear about promising prostate cancer research from the annual conference of the American Society of Clinical Oncology, Genitourinary, or ASCOGU 2023. My name is Dr. Ali Kandalani, and I'm a medical oncologist at the Jurovitsky Cancer Center and assistant professor at McMaster University in Ontario, Canada. One topic of importance that we will focus on in this video is triple therapy for newly diagnosed advanced hormone sensitive prostate cancer. That is new stage four prostate cancer. The treatment options for these patients have recently expanded beyond standard hormone therapy in the form of injection as the only treatment. For history, in 2015, an important scientific study called CHARTED showed that adding docetaxel chemotherapy to standard hormone therapy help patients live longer, meaning improved lifespan, in patients with prostate cancer that had spread significantly throughout the body, known as having high volume disease. Following this, multiple studies show that adding a next generation hormone therapy in the form of tablets, such as abiraterone with prednisone, or enzalutamide, or apalutamide, also help patients live longer and feel better, that is, improved quality of life, compared to hormone injections alone. Now, at the ASCO GU 2023 meeting, we saw new research from the Aerosens trial. This study showed that adding darolutamide, an oral next-generation hormone therapy, to chemotherapy with standard hormone injections as a three-drug combination or triple therapy was better than the two-drug combination of chemotherapy and standard hormone therapy in terms of improving the lifespan and quality of life for these patients. The updated research showed that patients with high volume or high risk disease, that is disease which has spread throughout the body or looks aggressive under a microscope, seemed to benefit the most. The research also showed there was minimal addition of side effects with this triple combination because of the unique tolerability profile with darolutamide. At this conference, there was also another set of results from the PEACE-1 trial. This trial previously showed that adding abiraterone with prednisone tablets to chemotherapy and standard hormone injections as a three-drug combination or triple therapy was better than chemotherapy and standard hormone therapy in terms of improving lifespan and quality of life of these patients who had high volume disease. New results showed that patients that were generally healthy or well enough to receive chemotherapy benefited from this triple therapy, whether their age was above or below 70 years. Side effects of this triple combination are more frequently reported with increasing age, which is consistent in most patients undergoing cancer treatment. What this means is that all men who have newly diagnosed advanced or stage four prostate cancer should discuss with their urologist or oncologist about treatment options beyond hormone injections alone. Currently used treatment would involve next generation hormone therapy tablets at a minimum. So that's abiraterone with prednisone or apalutamide or enzalutamide, or alternatively chemotherapy plus next generation hormone therapy tablets, in this case, darolutamide or abiraterone with prednisone. The choice of triple therapy or three drugs together, so again, standard hormone injections plus chemotherapy plus oral tablets, will depend on a discussion between patient and their oncologist about the extent that the cancer has spread and the suitability to receive chemotherapy. It does not appear that there is an age cutoff to benefit from this approach in prostate cancer, which is reassuring for patients and their oncologists. Regardless of the clinical practice setting, it is recommended that these decisions, called shared care decisions, be made jointly between the patient and his urologist and oncologist. We hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for your interest in therapeutic innovations in prostate cancer. 
and thank you for taking the time to listen.